Welcome back to the Steve Weber Show. Talking now with Brian Patterson. He is the president of Unplugged. Uh, he was the founder and president and CEO of First Research. Ryan also served two tours at the Defense Advanced Research Agency, 12 years in the United States Marine Corps. Now he is the president of Unplugged, a company uh, put together by Eric Prince. Of course, Eric Prince, the guy who put together Blackwater, knows a thing or two about security and being secure in the world. Um, and so I want to continue here uh, with this conversation, Ryan because you're giving me some of the ideas of what this phone would do. Now, Faraday boxes or Faraday bags are ways that people put their, their iPhone or, or their, you know, their phones in to be secure. You don't need to do any of that. This phone, Correct. the up phone from Unplugged, is the most secure smartphone ever built, right? So I, 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 I always caution people of saying the most or unhackable or things like that, because I've, I've spent a lot of time working with the people that do that for a living. And as soon as you tell somebody something's unhackable, um, you've got a big target on your back. So, so we, we've put a, we put a number of security and privacy enhancements into the phone uh, that we think give the average consumer and the average user way more privacy than they, than they have. There's a demonstration that I do for people that, that I show them what I can do with a thousand dollars buying data from the large data exchanges. So these are the people that collect the data that come from your phone because your phone has an, an, a mobile ad ID that's a eight to 10 digit character um, that identifies your phone. And that gets tied into every application on your phone, uses that, collects information on it. It has things about your, your location, your browsing history, uh, where you've been, uh, where you might be going. Um, and all of that is captured in there and sold to these uh, to these data exchanges, and they sell it over and over and over again to folks primarily to deliver targeted advertisements to you. We've all had that experience. But the thing is that data is being used by all kinds of people because it's not it's good not and bad. There's no regulation. Good people good, and, good and bad, bad people. And, and look, I, with the FISA decision that we bad. just talked about, uh, there's no limit on how they can violate the First Amendment or the Fourth Amendment or any amendment they want because they think that they're entitled to the information on you and I with or without a warrant. And that's what bothers me. And that's why this up Correct. phone is so important to me. Go on. Correct. Yeah, that, that's, that's exactly it. The Fourth Amendment is the issue for me uh, on, on, on phones, right? And so we did not give up our right to unreasonable search and seizure because we're using a communication device. The government still, if we still had landline phones, they would still have to have a warrant to capture and tap that that phone and what the expanded fisa came out and said I, look i'm i am shocked at some of the people that i saw that voted in favor of expanding this wasn't just so was keeping I. the patriot act going it yeah. was it dramatically expanding um fisa and so you know the, the things that we're doing encryption is not illegal so you can be encrypted um deciding to not tag all of your information uh, with your mobile ad ID is completely legal. It's just that the products we're currently offered don't do that. But, but, but the expansion of this is that everybody that provides any communications or, or computing capability to individuals must be compliant when they are subpoenaed and told to give up data. Right, and so here's the, the thing. Government, uh, the government you, you make a great provide point. provide me any reason. Whether it's Meta, TikTok, Google, Amazon, General Motors, I don't care who it is, they're, they're all collecting information, they're all listening to you, and, and even if you shut your phone off, my iPhone is what I use for years now, love it, it, you know, it does most of the things I want, it's like an electronic tether I voluntarily carry around with me, and so it is. But if I don't want that, if I don't want to be recorded, if I don't want to be on the grid, if I don't want my information being harvested, 24 hours a day, even when I sleep, the up phone gets me there. The up phone disconnects me from all of that oversight, plus the government. The government's another part of it. But I, I get to disconnect from all those people, for the most part. Like, you're not going to guarantee it or the best ever, whatever. I got that. But for practical application, it's the best there is currently, right? We surely believe so. Um, so I, I actually fly tomorrow to Las Vegas. The first 10,000 phones have come from our manufacturing partner in Indonesia. Uh, they arrived in Las Vegas. So everybody that's pre-ordered, they're going to start going out on Thursday. Uh, everybody that orders from here on out, they'll go out in one to two days after you get them. Um, 
no mobile ad ID. Uh, our, our privacy center is another thing that I'm that I'm very excited about. So it's it's a mechanism for you to tune how much you want to lock yourself down. Um, and and then there will be you know in the coming iterations of the software there'll be the ability for you to set some profiles, right? So for me running around inside of my home, back and forth to the grocery store. I, I'm not really that concerned. People know that I'm there anyway. Uh, right. Crossing an international border, going, going through a port of entry um, in certain places that I've traveled, uh, that thing will be, actually the, the, the kill switch will be on, so there will be no tracking, no emanation, no The kill switch, which means do, you are, you're invisible to the world with a kill switch on. Let, let me, before we run out of time here, because we've covered a lot of territory, sure. haven't even gotten to some some of the big topics I want to get to and ask you about, Ryan, but this is so fascinating. I'm fortunate to have one in my hand, by the way. I have an up phone right here in my hand. Where do people find it? The first 10,000 are coming in, uh, put together by you and Correct. Eric Prince and the people. Where do they find you right now? Unplug.com slash Gruber. And that's, a, that's the mechanism that you guys can use and, and, and give to your, your, uh, your listeners. And they can get to us there, uh, read all about the phone, get detailed specifications of it, uh, read the blogs we've written about things like the First and Fourth Amendments and how the tracking works. Uh, all of it's there, unplug.com forward slash Gruber. All right, unplug.com slash Gruber. Uh, Ryan, I want to talk to you so much more. Uh, we've got so many more things to talk about. I haven't talked about Ukraine or Gaza in detail because of all the places that are on fire in this world. But one of the places we can protect people is with their own constitution and defend themselves from their own government right here at home. Ryan Patterson from Unplugged, thank you for being here today. Thank you, Steve. It was great to be with you. you Happy it. to come Unplugged. back anytime. There you have it. Unplugged.com slash Gruber. Find out more today. This is The Steve Gruber Show.